Make your point on the news hour. Join Arnab every night on the news hour with your question. Ask your question and join the debate. Well, yes, some breaking news coming in from Afghanistan. An explosion in Kabul leaves several people dead and a few others injured as a minibus carrying government officials exploded. Now, initial reports also claiming that it was a suicide bombing explosion in Kabul. And Aditya is with us now on, on the phone line to get us more details. Aditya, what are the details of this incident? How many casualties and injuries have been reported so far? Well, yes, uh, at least a couple of hours ago, early morning in Kabul, uh, the capital of Afghanistan, a bomb blast was reported. And we are now being told that this was in the Pule Cherki area of uh, the Kabul city. Uh, this is in the police district 9. And a mini bus was, uh, you know, traveling to a destination in which uh, at least 20 to 30 people were uh, seated. Most of them were Nepalese citizens. And uh, a suicide bomber, uh, uh, you know, blew himself up inside the bus in which uh, till now we are being told that at least 14 people have been killed and uh, there are at least a dozen others who could be injured and have been really sent to the nearby hospitals. The investigations are on. We are also being told that just a few minutes ago, Taliban has taken responsibility for this bomb blast. So yet again, Taliban trying to perhaps send out a message, uh, uh, not just to the Western countries, but also to the leadership in Afghanistan, that they are still very much active and will continue mm. to, you know, spread bloodshed and violence. But yes, uh, uh, the police and uh, the AN ANF troops have reached uh, the spot. The area has been sanitized completely. But yes, a tragedy occurring yet again in the Kabul city. At least 14 and, people uh, Aditya, have been... what was the prime target in this attack? Was it those uh, government officials who were inside the minibus or was it the foreign nationals who also uh, were, were using this vehicle? Well, yes, uh, the diplomatic area, foreign nationals and the government officials, apart from uh, the army, are a regular target of the Taliban. In this particular case, we are being told that uh, most of those who were traveling in the bus were Nepalese citizens. And, you know, most of the 14 people who have been killed are also foreign nationals from Nepal. So we'll have to, you know, wait and watch for the final figure. But as of now, we are being told that these were foreign nationals and they were government officials. And that is why the Taliban chose to target them. But yes, a very unfortunate event taking place. So the investigations are currently on uh, and the Ministry of Interior in Kabul will uh, come out with the details shortly. All right. In fact, we are waiting for those details to really come in through official channels and also try and get some inputs from Kabul itself. But foreign nationals were clearly targeted in this attack by the Taliban, in which 13 people are reportedly killed and 26 are injured as per the figures uh, available at this point in time. This explosion was in Afghan capital, uh, Kabul, and uh, it was in a minibus which was carrying government officials. Uh, 